Hey guys, it's Shani and I'm back today with another plan with me and for this week's spread I am using this kit from Paper Crown Planner. This was actually a printable kit and I've been loving printables. I try to throw them in every here and there. They're like way more budget friendly and they're just really nice. Like, I don't know, I just think the kits are really nice you get them instantly so there's no like waiting game with like shipping times like I said they're a lot cheaper um, I know a lot of shops I think including paper crown planner do two dollar Tuesday um, and so you can literally get a printable kit for like I don't know maybe 250 Canadian or something like that or maybe three bucks Canadian which is so much better um, considering that like most full kits are I don't know like 30 bucks <laughs> so it works out really well. Um, I do try to throw them um, in every here and there. I don't always use them um, because I do still like purchasing kits. It's still fun. You get to try new paper and new, um, like, I don't know, new designs from other shops. But sometimes it's nice to save a little bit of money. So the first time I used this kit was, I think, sometime in July. Um, and I loved that spread so much. Like, you guys have no idea. It's honestly one of my, like, top spreads from this year. I can't remember if I've posted it on Instagram or not yet. I don't think so. But if I have, then make sure to check it out. And if I haven't, then make sure to look out for it. But <laughs> I loved it so much. And I knew that I, like, wanted to use the leftovers to do another spread. And I think this one turned out really pretty as well. I don't love it as much as that first one, but that first one was just like a fluke and I thought it turned out stunning. Um, but yeah, so I used these glitter headers that were actually from another kit. Um, I was trying to use them with another kit and then I decided to use some other headers for that kit and I was like, oh, these go so well with this. I want to pull out some of that hot pink. So they were a little bit darker than I'd wanted, but... Um, I don't know, I decided to use decided to use them anyways and I already had like glitter header overlays on top of them from Planner Choco. So, I didn't really want to like throw them out or anything, so I don't know. I thought they matched like well enough. And then I moved on to the sidebar and whited it out and then I put one of the full boxes since I had all those right there um, like full boxes left over since there were a bunch in this kit. I think there were like 10 pages in this kit. Um because, you know, it's a printable so they can add like a ton of options, which is awesome. But yeah, so I used that and then I put on top of it a half box as well as this like traveling, hiking, walking, whatever you want to see it as, Ava. And I wrote where I was this week. So this week I was in Barcelona in Michigan. And then on Monday, the first thing that I wrote down was that my friend Renit was leaving. I was still in Barcelona for Monday, Tuesday, and like part of Wednesday. This was so long ago now. I've really got to catch up on my spreads, but I've just been working so much that it's a little difficult. But one of these days I will catch up. And if not, I will maybe do another like big catch up in December, kind of like I did um, in 2018 where I posted a plan with me like every day those are kind of my thoughts because I honestly don't know when I'll have like a bunch of time off again I start school in like a month and until then I'm working and I'm like going away some weekends so you know my schedule is a little tight <laughs> so we will see how that works out but that was what I marked down I used a little airplane icon as well as this cute little flag uh, to mark that and then underneath that, I used a half box as well as this really pretty deco sticker. Um, there was some really stunning deco in this kit. I loved it and I used some of it in my main spread. So I wanted to bring some more of it in here because I think it really added to the overall look. Um, so I just wrote down that we went to this um, like city or place called Montserrat. Uh, and we did a bunch of like walking around and hiking around. There was a lot of like things to walk up and down, a lot of really pretty views. So I thought the little like pretty shoes were appropriate. And guys, I literally want those shoes. Like, can you please make stickers into real life objects? Because I want those shoes. <laughs> and then at the end of Mar Monday, I marked down that we just went to this place called Marhaba and hung out there. I used a little label that has like a cute little bow on top. So I thought that was appropriate. And then on Tuesday, I used that same little label, but in a different color. And that was to mark down that we went to the church that Gaudi, I think, designed. Um, it was called uh, Sagrada Familia. I did also forget to mention that I had this kit from Regina Laughs that actually the art matched perfectly. And I just did a spread with that like on my own time. I didn't film it or anything. Um, and then I had a ton of leftovers and I really love a lot of her like functional stickers and icons and stuff. So I wanted to keep those and I pulled some of them in as well. 
and then I use this like bow quarter box or label I guess um, to mark down that my friend like her boyfriend and his friends were coming into Barcelona as well so they all came to our Airbnb we just hung out there and had some drinks and then after that we all went to dinner together we went to like the Spanish place and they all got paella but I really wanted risotto because I had some amazing risotto in um uh, in Italy and I was like craving it like crazy but of course it wasn't nearly as good but I'm also just not a huge seafood person, so I didn't really want paella. I tried it, like, another night, so I was like, okay, like, I kind of get what it is. I don't need to be eating it, like, a hundred times on this trip. <laughs> but for that, I used a um, meal icon from the kit as well as a little heart from Regina's kit. And then afterwards, we went to a, a bar for a little bit. I think I had maybe, like, one drink um, because I was leaving the next day or we were all leaving the next day. So I knew I had to be up early, so I didn't want to drink too much. Um, but to mark that, I used a wine drinking Ava. And then on Wednesday, I marked my flight with this flight tracker. I do kind of not like um, that the flight tracker and the label beside it are like the same color, but I don't know. I thought the flight tracker was perfect. So I was kind of like, whatever. And then I used a label from Regina's kit as well as this house icon from the Paper Crown Planner kit to mark down that my parents picked me up from the airport and we went home and I hadn't been home in so long so it was kind of nice I was like wow it's so nice being home my bed I missed it so much <laughs> and then I hadn't seen Yanni for about a week because I was in Barcelona of course and he went home after Italy so I wanted to see him and I used a little bow for that from the kit and then at night, I was just doing some planner catch up since I didn't take any of my planners with me. So, you know, had a lot of things to catch up on. And again, that was from the Paper Crown Planner Kit. And then Thursday, I started off at the bottom. I used another one of those labels with the bow stickers already on it to mark down that I watched the NBA Finals game with Yanni. And then before that, I did also paint my nails since I was leaving the next day and I really needed to do my nails since, you know, it had been like three weeks since I'd had them done. So they were looking a little bit rough. <laughs> um, and I used that paint nails sticker from the Paper Crown Planner Kit. Um, before that, I marked down that I did some um, unpacking and then repacking for the weekend. Uh, and I just used a like a glitter label as well as this like checklist thing. I thought that was appropriate. I thought it was kind of cute and matched the kit so I didn't really feel the need to pull in a like suitcase sticker. And then before that I did also have to make a call to my school. I don't remember what it was for but I had to call them so I used the cell phone icon from the kit and then I pulled in a little uh, like silver foiled bow icon and layered it on top of there. And then Friday, I put, the first thing I put down was that uh, we went to Shabbat dinner, or really it was just a regular dinner <laughs> on a Friday, um, but I went to some family's house since we were in Michigan. So yeah, on Friday, we got up early, early and drove down to Michigan. It wasn't too bad. I think it was like a four or five hour drive, which really isn't bad. Um, like considering we have a ton of family that lives there, it's, it was really nice to see them. And I wrote down that we had some McDonald's coffee on the way. I think we stopped like once or twice. We love coffee in this family. So I used a coffee cup sticker from Regina's kit. And then underneath that, I wrote down that my mom and I purchased some Dear Evan Hansen stick stickers, <laughs> uh, tickets. <laughs> and I used a like icon with some like money stuff on it from the kit. And then I also forgot to mention, but I used a family time sticker also from the Paper Crown Planner Kit. I really love her scripts with the icons. I think they look so good and I love that they match like the kit. I think it looks really awesome. So I used a bunch of those. I see like one, two, three, four of them in the spread. So really like that. And then on both Saturday and Sunday, I wanted to use a half box as well since, you know, we did kind of bigger things. So on Saturday, the first thing that I put down, I think I'm about to put it down now, but it was that I had new releases go up. I had a ton of releases, so I thought that was really perfect for marking that down. Again, that was from the kit. And then we went to synagogue since, like I said, we were there for a bat mitzvah. I mentioned this in my last plan with me, but um, yeah, so we went to synagogue. I never really go to synagogue. Like, I'm not really religious or anything, but of course, if there's like a rhyme and reason, then of course I will go. 
Um, and then afterwards, my cousin and I really wanted to get some Tarte Shape Tape because <laughs> we don't have it here. We don't have Ulta, which is just tragic. But we did go to Ulta, so I used a shopping bag icon from Regina's kit. And then in the evening, we actually had the bat mitzvah party, so that's just what I wrote in the half box. I didn't add any icons to it because it was a really cute like little butterfly deco, so I thought that would do. And then Sunday, that half box right at the top was for a family like brunch slash barbecue. There was so much food. You literally can choose if you want a brunch, brunch food or lunch food, whatever you want. <laughs> so it was really awesome. And it was at some of our family's house and their house was really cool. It was actually really interesting. Um, yeah, I think I mentioned this as well as in my last like plan with me, but it had like some historic, it was like a historic site, but it was like their house. So it was really cool actually. Um, and that's what I wrote down in that half box. And then this was actually done before we went for brunch, but I just marked it after since I thought it looked cuter. We did go to Costco before brunch, so I marked that down with a shopping cart icon. And then after brunch, we went to Target, so I used some um, shopping bag icons there. I think I meant to write shopping cart or shop say shopping cart. I used some shopping carts and then shopping bags. <laughs> and then the last thing that I marked was that this was our last evening and we just went to this place called Buddy's Pizza. Um, like a bunch of us and all got some food. The food was okay, it was not bad at all. Um, but yeah, so then afterwards I went ahead and grabbed the date dots, put those down, added a bit of these like heart deco stickers that are foiled to the spread and those are from my shop. I just like adding a little bit of foil here and there since I didn't really use much throughout the spread, which is so unlike me, but the icons and everything in the kits were just so perfect that I really wanted to have them stand out on their own. But yeah, that was pretty much it for this video. I really hope you guys liked it. Please subscribe, thumbs up, do all that good stuff, and I will see you guys in my next plan with me. Bye!